And welcome in, everybody. Glad you're with us. Sunday baseball on the show. It's the Los Angeles Angels and the Toronto Blue Jays. And now. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. Blue Jays. Ready to go. And on the hill, Theo Ray. What do we need to know here? Well, he tried to make it through the fifth inning last time out, but the pitch count just got too high. He ended up taking the loss. That's one of those you just have to shake it off, come back out today, and try to throw a gym. Swung on, belted. That's back there. And gone. He circles the bases, and they throw three on the board. It's 3-0. He ambushed him right there, Siggy. Yeah, swinging on that first pitch, and I think losing one over the fence is exactly what he had in mind as well. He came out of his shoes on that one, but managed to keep his mechanics intact long enough to get to the ball and through it, and it went a long way. One out, base is loaded. Gerald Raymond, the next to hit for the Angels. Pretty amazing athlete this guy is. Power and speed, quite a threat. I mean, you're talking about someone that could steal your bag and go deep. Bo Jackson, anyone? That one back up the middle, and it gets through. One run is in. Another scores. Two runs in on the play, and the lead is up to five. Well, clearly he was ready to hit right there. Really nice job staying up the middle with his approach. He didn't try to do too much with the pitch. Just shot it through the infield. Here comes the manager out of the dugout, and he'll make a move for the bullpen. Theo Ray done for the day, and as he heads off, we'll step aside for a minute. Back with the new pitcher after this break. Bill Graves gets handed the rock out of the pen, and he's getting thrown into the fire with a pair of runners in scoring position. Now it's the right fielder, Alonso Thomas. 0 for 1 with a fly out. Next offering is in for a strike. When you have a real athletic player and who's able to do the baseball mechanical things really well, look out because the sky's the limit on that potential. And he deals. This one smoked out to left. Can't get their base hit. One run is in. Raymond around third. Marshall with a relay throw. Safe at the plate. It's seven to nothing. Nice double right there. Loud contact coming off the bat. Didn't get enough air under to drive it out of here, but you'll take that swing and that result every time. One out, base is empty. Ken Bryant next up for the Blue Jays. The right fielder, Ken Bryant. Trying to bunt his way on. And that's a bunt single. That was placed perfectly. First and third, two away. Gerald Raymond getting ready to hit. And that one fouled off. Hey, square one up. One time. Lifted in the air, right center field. Scott makes the catch, and that'll do it. We head down to the home half of inning number three. It's the Angels eight, and the Jays nothing. So here's the cleanup hitter, Tim Marshall. He's 0 for 1. It's softly on the ground, left side. 
two away. Well, he's doing a nice job of keeping the ball out of the air. Let's the defense work behind him with another ground ball. Good execution. Pretty good job on the mound in this one. Man at first. And now here is Gerald Raymond. This is a true five-tool guy. Not very many of them out there, but when he's on the field, you can't take your eye off of him. Hey, get your pitch. Drive it right here. Now a high fly ball out to left center. Scott glides back. That's down. One hops off the wall. Throw cut off. He's down to the plate. Play. In there. He scores. It's 9-0. Went up there looking to be aggressive and got something he could handle. Man, I love the hustle out of the box right there to make that triple happen. And just an absolute laser into the opposite field gap. He was digging hard the entire way. Alonso Thomas, the next to hit for the Angels. The pitch. And one and two. Fans come to the ballpark to watch him play. And in baseball, to have such a talented player going out there every day and putting on the show that he does, just a joy to watch. Swings and misses. One down. Bell Boog, it becomes pretty difficult as a teammate when a guy's struggling like this. You don't know if you want to go up and tell him to keep swinging it or if you want to give him his space, what exactly he needs. But right now, it's clearly a struggle for him, and you're just hoping that Somehow, some way, it'll click, and he can get out of this as quickly as possible. And makes the grab. Runner tags for home. Throw is offline, and he scores. And it's a double-digit lead as they're up by 10. So in now for the Angels, Gerald Raymond. Ah, oh, yeah, Boog. He's on the brink of one of your favorite milestones. He's completed three legs of the cycle. I love me some cycle. And that's ripped into left. Base hit. So a man aboard now with one away. Nice hit, big dog. And that's what he needed. He has done it. What a performance at the plate. He's come through for him at the plate in every way possible in this one. It might be a little bit of a quirk in terms of stats, but it's still a great achievement. Not something a lot of players have been able to do. And now, Alonso Thomas. A strikeout and a walk. In the air, right field. Bryant drifts towards it. And there's two down. Maybe caught that one off the end just a little bit. Couldn't quite barrel it up enough to really drive it. The batter, the catcher, Javier. Man at first, and next for L.A., Javier Guerrero. Taken high in the draft, he's had that top prospect label over him since he put on a professional uniform. But at some point, that starts to go away, and you've got to produce at the big league level. And there he goes. Pitch misses inside. And it's safe. It's a stolen base. Chris, his wheels were the difference maker on that play. Just got in there. Yeah, with StatCast's help, we see his top speed on this stolen base, and that's a big number. I mean, man, he really made his athleticism work for him on that one. And it's even up. Well, and those hitters count sometimes can be a little too aggressive, and a good pitcher will play off of that. He's got to get a better pitch to hit. Hey, find some green, baby. Find some green. Two outs. And fouled off. Oh, baby, see you drive it. Line drive to short and caught. Angels leave one, but they still hold a 10-0 lead. It has become increasingly difficult to throw a complete game shutout because of all of the offensive prowess that these hitters are showing around the league today. But he had total command of this game, and he saw it all the way through to the end. Nice win. Ten zip your final in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew here at MLB The Show, 